Welcome back to the Binding of Isaac. Hopefully, we will not roll into uh, Tainted Judas again. We will not. Good news. Alright. We'll do our best. We need to make Boss of Shinhash eventually, so we might as well try for it right now. Um, hmm. Yeah, I suppose we'll just try to go forward besides that. Doesn't really matter. I'll take both though, regardless. I think it's it's good enough. We're not touching B side. We gotta you know walk with everything. You're gonna leave that right there, and we're gonna come back for that later. So we're just gonna leave all of that right there because it's easier to just come back to it all once we actually need the health. Now we have this guy instead. He's not as good as Seraphim probably, but he's still good. And we do need to make sure we use our, you know, people correctly. We don't want to waste it. And yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll flip back onto a uh, living Laz at the end of the floor. So, no worries. I don't care who has Tonsil. I don't think it's going to make a very big difference. And he can get another Solar on top of this. Oh, could... If, if that last room, that last un, unlook that room, is uh, enemies, I could give one to a uh, dead Laz, and I kind of like that idea. Because I am also going to go to the coast room before I uh, touch the uh, soul heart, just in case there's even more. So, and so, you know, especially if there is... Wow, that was a very short-lived penny. But yeah, especially if there was soul hearts in here, I definitely would have liked to give that. That's a real cry and shame. Uh, this is what it is, I guess, but still. Alright, well, let's see if this is a room with enemies. It is not, although I will take a peek at the shop. Doesn't matter. Okay. Then, yeah, I guess you just get two of them then. Enjoy. Tainted uh, Laz that is living specifically. Alright, next flow, pretty good pace. Thus far, only two minutes for the first flow. It's probably better than a lot of people have acquired on, on this character in particular. This room's a little funky, but Seraphim's helping. Apparently does enough damage to one-shot the spiders, so that's nice. Let's get this down before it gets spawning anything. Same for this guy, really. Do you have an arcade? Noted, I guess. Probably, I mean, I'll look. You never know. But I, I don't expect much in it. Yeah, I don't care. Unless, I don't know, maybe we find a bunch of keys. I, I would be willing to take a look at the shop for a chance to explode it. Yeah, kind of relying on little brim, which is not great, but it's it's good enough for the early game at least to carry without too much issue. Did that? I don't know. I might have hit the trite, but I, I'm a little skeptical that Seraphim might have just one shot a trite. Oh, hello. Nothing of real nope. We got our bomb back, so nothing to complain about either. Yeah, out of here. So, okay, I mean, it's it's a shame, but it's not the biggest loss in the world, I suppose. Well, I mean, both of us, both of these, these goobers got uh, some pretty solid familiars to support them at the moment. And, and I think that's more relevant. Sackdag? I don't care. Golden Razor and still Sack Dag. It's always going to be Sack Dag. Um, hmm. Well, I guess then. then I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I'll just keep rolling. I don't really want that either. Okay, that is fantastic. Yes. Um, 
I will try to get something better on this side. I'm not crazy about Sack Dag. Satanic Bible, that works for me. I'm gonna not use it until after the boss. I don't know if that's a hot take. It shouldn't be because I want angels. Uh, have I done Mega Satan? I have, so I don't have to go Mega Satan. Kinda like the idea of it. Just for the, um, you know, delirium chance. Uh, so I'll, I'll probably still be going that way, but regardless. Okay, I don't care then. Good damage. If this gives us a range up, I will absolutely go clear that last room. Did not. Uh, in that case, yeah, y you can have it. I don't care. But yeah, we got a great setup now going for um, for Living Laz. Dead Laz is doing alright too, just by his, the virtues of being Dead Laz. Key is good, obviously. Let's try to be a bit more proactive on like secret rooms if we can. Try to find them as we go rather than like being at the end of the floor and then trying to find them mentally. <laughs> Because I don't really remember the rooms more often than not, the specific layouts. I'll go this way, why not? Okay, yeah, these guys kind of suck <laughs> for me, personally, on that character. And thus far, that looks like a potential secret room below that last room that we were in. Okay, what you got? Zit and dry baby. I guess, honestly, zit is kind of decent for you. It's not, like, amazing, but it's some supplemental firepower uh, that is unaffected by my range stat as far as I'm concerned. Or not concerned as far as I'm, I'm aware. That's pretty good. What is, is that? I think that's coast eye, so I don't think I care. I'm correct. I do not kill. Fortunately, I don't think that works on the uh, flip, flip side. <laughs> yeah, now we can get some, some sack. Sack head is great. Should keep us easily, consistently high on on keys and whatnot. Just consumables, really. I imagine the zit will probably be more helpful for bosses than actually clearing rooms and whatnot. Still in decent pace. Still don't want to dilly dally or anything. But we're doing alright. Ooh, how fun. Time to never use that. Because <laughs> we're not going devil kills, if you may recall. Okay, we're going to be able to get another. Bible use by the end of the flow, because we'll flip back over. I don't I, I don't really want the devil deals and whatnot. I'm pretty sure even with like found soul it would still count. Actually how about how about this? I do not like that position. <laughs> you can keep your soul. But uh Black Rune, I can drop that, and so now if it's not a range up... Actually, wait, no, that's ex this is the exact opposite of who would need it. Sorry. <laughs> Thinking completely wrong. Alright, there we go. I am willing to flip over for uh, the ability to... Although, uh, you know, it's probably best to just go and clear a room, because odds are that's quite viable. Doubt doing the challenge room would be faster. I do think it would still flip me technically by the end. I believe it's an odd number of room clears at the end of it. But yeah, just clear room, flip over that way. And frankly, little Chad, not very good. So I think this is a pretty solid use of Black Rune. Gives us some stat ups, hopefully range, but honestly, as long as it's not speed and shot speed, I'll be happy. It's range. Great. Uh, and shot speed, which is less relevant. But the range is fantastic. The range is great. 
that gets us almost at average a little bit below i believe but you know it's it's a negligible amount to be below by two minutes to get it, to stay on pace for the, this floor generally i like to be able to have five minutes per depth because they're you know they're longer obviously not a bad one though thus far you know cricket's head obviously helps for uh, living and the the firepower and the damage output on on dead laz is pretty solid as well some of that's just because of dead laz being dead laz but oh even better uh but even regardless of that the uh seraphim is also pretty nice hey i will take you and pick up this cash before i give it i don't care enough to uh commit to that soul of eve ace of spades let's use ace of spades and then come back with soul of eve on uh whoever it doesn't really matter yeah this guy can have it show who cares <laughs> Don't really care about the chariot that much, frankly. Probably not gonna bother coming back for it. Bunch of keys, though. No worries of running out of them now. Shame that it was a dead end. That's what it is, though. Hopefully... Um... Hopefully we can find a speed up soon, because dead lads being below average is definitely holding. Especially on that walk back last floor, it was definitely a bit obnoxious. Okay. Imagine you can get down, yeah. Or anything terrible average. Hey, look, it's a range down. <laughs> How fantastic. Get out of here. Will you cause any harm? Oh, you uh, should have seen me from further than I thought. <laughs> Great on money. If we can find the shop, that'd be great. If we can't, so be it. You know, we'll just leave that up to the grace of God. You know, I'm a very religious man, so I, I, I and I, my faith uh, persevered and it paid off, as is to be expected, of course. Ooh, zooey mama! I absolutely want this on this guy. I think that would be very solid. Uh, I don't really care about any of this, but I will grab a soul hoach. I think we got some potential here. Yeah. Decent range. Supplemental firepower of... Good ol' what's-his-face Lil Brim. So, hopefully we can just get a bit more damage going, or, or something like that, on on this fellow. Um, yeah, I mean, it doesn't particularly matter who has this, in my opinion. <laughs> just gonna act like it's not there, and I think we'll be fine that way. At least I can get... Oh! That was a bit precarious. At least I can get the key piece. And the wave was good, of course. It's just not Sacred Heart. You know? It's just not Sacred Heart. Alright, well, we're at 12 minutes going into depths. Probably we'll be fine. Still gotta make sure to keep moving, though. Keep a steady fire. Keep using Little Broom as well. Where did you go? Hey, look at you. Falls of Seal. Okay, well, great. If by any chance we could get this, uh... This thing, this, this active onto the other fella, that would be... Uh, I think that would be good. They seem to be doing... Just fine on health for the dead guy, so. Doesn't really seem too necessary. 
I'm not, I'm not. I do like pop, but I don't really want keymaster. I don't think. Oh, oh, that's such a fun concept. Dare I? I think I dare. Let's do it. Eucharist? That's about it. That's about the only notable thing that I got there. Okay. I mean... <laughs> what can I say? Here we are. What the heck? He got like nudged into me constantly. Was that Teratoma or something? I don't even know. Gotta clear another room to, uh, you know, be funny. To get pop on the person we like. I I'll take Keymaster. Whatever, we'll show. Oh, oh, it got rolled into something good. Okay. Comparatively good, at least. And I think with Pop, this is... It's at least got more potential, if not direct value. Now, I, I guess Eucharist is a global effect, because it seems to be constantly there. At 100%, so, oh, oh, maybe it's like, uh, oh, you see it once and it just hits for the entire floor or something? I don't know, I'm just kind of spitballing here. I think Blood Cloud is probably helpful. That is, that is very helpful. It's a shame we can't get the, uh, the, the staircase, but it is what it is. Spirit Blade is gonna be great, though, for sure. That is gonna, I, I think we have... I, I don't want to go as far as to say winning, but I do think we have a very good run with good odds of winning. And we've got our key pieces, so we can go to the the place, we can go Mega Satan to get our... If we don't get Delirium from uh, Blue Baby, which is like a 25% chance, so statistically we won't. We definitely don't see it that much. Let's just pop the moon, I don't care. Uh, interesting. I mean, I'll, I'll take it, whatever, sure. Cool, I guess. Okay, um... And there's the shop. Well, obviously you need to find the Tenant Skull before much of anything else. Smelter. Not crazy about Smelter. Uh, stopwatch. I do kind of like the idea of stopwatch for uh, this guy. Um, yeah, sure. And then... I guess I can buy Smelter and just put it down. I don't know if that will ever become accessible. But whatever. Yeah. Eh. Surely... Car battery would not flip me twice. I'm not going to risk it, though. I'm not going to make such a, a play. And besides, like, what am I going to use car battery for? I don't even have an active on this guy. Here's the thin skull. I will just leave that on the ground until I uh, go to kill the boss. And then I will pick it up and drop it when I enter the room. Go anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Killing a poisoned brain. This 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 time this night at nine. I don't I don't know, I'm not a news anchor. Swag money. Wait, no! Yes. Wait, stop. Drop it. Pick it up, use it there, take this, kill him. Alright. <laughs> oh, wow, how interesting. If only I still had my soul. Um, you know, I'd like to come back here as, like, potentially that other guy. I guess I could just Bible it up here. What's on the B side? 
Nothing of crazy importance. Um, yeah, I, I'd like to... Why did I need the fool so bad? I'd like to... Um, I guess just for ease of killing. I don't know. I can go do this. What, what the hell? Why not? I'll come back for Alabaster Box in the future, I think. I guess it's not too important that I pick it up right now. Um, I guess you can have a damage up. Oh, no. No, no. I've made a grave arrow. Is this allowed? Can I do this? I'm gonna do it. I don't care. You can watch me be the scum of the earth. I care not. Ooh, wow. That's pretty good. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to leave that soul out there. And then... These are all pretty mid. Um, can get tears up on this guy? I, I guess there is uh, the D6 in there. I would like that. Yeah, we can take the D6 on this guy. Alright. It's going to definitely be a bit slow on this fella. It is what it is. Bone cage, not very good. I, I'd like to continue trying to reroll that. Bone cage is okay. It's, it's just a better dead boat at the end of the day. We're just gonna leave that full card on the ground until we uh leave. I'll leave it. Okay, she is into the funny mode. Hopefully, yeah, hopefully we can really get something going soon with, um... Oh, swag. So this is just nothing, basically. <laughs> uh, take the, take the soul out. You can take the soul out. It's, it's fine. Because the soul hearts on this room... I, odds are, there's a good chance we don't make hush. I'm gonna be realistic here. And, you know, in that case, we we'll also probably, that also means we're probably taking a while on, on this fight. That's really the, the what I'm trying to get at here. We're gonna take a while on this fight, most likely. We already have taken a, a minute. We're definitely not gonna be able to get back inside, uh, at the very least. So, okay, you're going up here. <laughs> Hey, get out of here. Oh! Oh! Stop touching me! You're too hostile. Okay. Uh, yeah, a little portal, by the way, sucks. Hot take, I don't know. Some people may disagree with me, though. You mean it? Some loser constantly eating your stuff that you don't want him to eat because he's not even like easy to not shoot. He's lame. That's crazy. Don't. Okay. You <laughs> guy, you 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 pushing your luck there, Gordy Jr. Okay, finally. Good load. Keep hello. Okay. Definitely want to fight everyone on uh, on Dead Laz though at this point, as he's hopefully made apparent by the incredible damage in comparison to the two. Oh my God! How did I not get hit? <laughs> okay. I didn't hit him. Could have sworn I had a charge there. Ah! I'm losing. I'm hemorrhaging health. Where is the ragster? There he is. Okay. Pupula duplex. I actually like that. It's a big issue often for uh, for this item is the, uh, the 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 tears are so small that you can easily miss. And uh, you know, with the the zaniness of the tears themselves, it's often good to have some 
some form of making the tears hit more or be more likely to hit. Uh, and increasing their hitbox, that'll do it. Now granted this does mean they're gonna hit each other more and you know maybe that's not optimal all the time but I think it's generally good. I'm a bit befuddled by that uh, damage. But it doesn't seem to be too impactful. Why are you doing that? <laughs> I'm confused. Ah, this is this is a real tricky uh, balance. What are you doing, ha ha haunts, hosts? Just go. I don't care about the lovers card. Balancing the adversary and uh, haunt is a little bit obnoxious. IMO. Good idea. Actually, I honestly should have given that to uh, the other guy. Now that I think about it. But, whatever. Should have just re-rolled it. Even better idea. Crazy. I did not think at all. In, in so many ways. Did you know one of these brimstone beams that the uh, Forsaken, I think, shoots, does double damage? Probably not. <laughs> but, uh, I do. I don't know which one. But one of them. Ugh, I do not like the Toadlings. They, they are unreasonably more difficult than the, uh, the Goglings. Because they, they spawn so many ads. Like, yeah, they're all low health ads, but still. They spawn like three of them, and they shoot out from them at rapid fire speeds. Unless you're in a big room like this, they're going to be obnoxious. Also, we've, we've got to be near the end. This is a great time to have uh, this particular fella enabled. How did I not deflect that? Okay, are we done? Yes. We'll give me a damage up, and it's a health up. And finally, we can full code. Yeah, that, uh, hush is probably not happening. I'm, I'm gonna be the realist here. Unless we get some input code or an XL flow. I, I don't think hush is, is all that likely. And that's okay. Getting one of them done is, is nice in and of itself. Plus, we're, we're probably going to be able to get the uh, Polaroid done. Even if via, you know, some unscrupulous methods. It's my file. I can do what I want. If I made a stupid, obviously don't do that mistake, then I can undo that. This is trash. I'd rather we roll things back at the black market. Nothing really there, okay. Let us continue to pull. I'll, I'll blow these up. I think it is more relevant to, uh, Save the soul hearts on the ground for this fella to to eat up. No, come here. When you do that, okay, it was trash. Okay, then that is basically that. Um. Well, like I said, I'll. I'll buy this. I don't think there's any like active pedestal lying around, so I'm gonna have to go outside of the room and flip. And you can have this. As for any of this stuff, uh, show sure, you can have a post. Why not? Fish too. Uh, okay. Interesting. 
I think backpack could be real nice for either of them. Fortunately, I don't think... Honestly, I don't think either are going to get too much use out of it, so probably won't take that. Um, Battery babies, just a solid choice. I don't really care about the rest. Both right? Okay. What would that do? That would give this guy some garbage. Um, is there a room? Please, somehow, let there be a room where I could hypothetically get a charge. There is a, uh, is, there's the coach room. There's also maybe a super secret room. No such luck here, but it's all hard at least. Grab these while we're wandering. I could go down to a very low amount of HP and uh, go to the, the challenge room. <laughs> I'm not crazy about that idea. Um, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I'm not that interested in work, right? Yeah, um, unless the super secret room has a charge, I don't know, I'll try, maybe you could have a full battery. Oh my god, it had a full battery. <laughs> I am astonished. Do not make some stupid mistake either. Flip before you go in. Take that. If I'm not mistaken how that works. Oh wait, no, I was thinking of Jacob and Esau. My mistake. I see, I see. Okay, interesting. Uh, you know, I could take a modem show, show. I, I, I doubt I'm gonna be interested in much else here. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna reroll on the off chance of something really good showing up. I don't know what that would even qualify as, but you know. I'll try. That qualifies. <laughs> and then we get to give a soul heart to this guy. So, you know, I think that's a win-win-win all across the board. So we can make Hush. We can uh, we can actually go to Hush. Can you believe that? <laughs> the comeback of the century. All right, then. Uh, yeah, let's... Yeah. Wasn't anything in here, right? <laughs> okay then. But yeah, the both right for tangent Laz, in case you didn't notice, it's fairly obvious. You basically become bootleg Jacob and Esau. Sorry, my door just opened by the mere force of nature. Uh and I got a little surprised. Um But yeah, Jake it, it adds a, a doppel, basically. It adds your doppel. And it does like a tenth of its base damage, I think. Something like that. Uh, and yeah, it's yeah, just a benefit, basically. You can have a uh, flip on the other... You can have the other thing on the other guy. Sure. I know your range down. <laughs> you grained in my brain. Put the range up for you. Why the heck not? Leave the balls of steel though for uh, for the future. Swag. And also you have like all of their passives constantly active so that's really nice. A little bit of a side benefit there. I really hope and I imagine it, it won't but I really hope that black markets don't, you know, affect Alabaster Rocks, because I know if you take um, a, a Devil Deal with Alabaster Box, it will um, only pay out with, like, half the rewards that it normally would. And so, I don't imagine it will, because it's not a Devil Deal, it's not considered a Devil Deal by any other part of the game, so why would it for specifically Alabaster Box? But it's still a, a mild view I hold, regardless. 
Man, we can D10 enemies with our... Uh, well, maybe it's not D10. I don't know. But we can do something to our enemies. So we will uh, garbage like that. I, I mean, I could, but I don't really care. I should try for a secret room there. That is pretty valid. Swag. Why not? Speed up. Yeah, you can have it. Gotta start saving keys though, because we all decently low. Dog, I'm not even touching you anymore. Just open. You can re-roll. That was a glow up of the century. Turned into a key and a penny. I almost kind of just walked into one of their bullets. That would have been a shame. I'm not gonna like super min max the uh, the funny. What is this range up? Another range up shit. Range up. Also, uh, you know, you can have one of these now. <laughs> Snow home in it. This is an XL for right? I'm just making sure. Just wait until they inevitably touch, yeah. <laughs> so you can get rolled. Oh wait, no, that worked. Sorry, I was a little scared that I botched something. Okay, um... Staircase is good, obviously, and it doesn't really matter who has it. You can have that, because you're more likely to get hit. Uh... Take a couple more. I want to see if the staircase generated. Because I think it might. If you get it, like, afterwards. I don't... Oops. It does not. Okay. Fine. I think, I think I'm thinking of the ascension. If you do that. But, whatever. Open up. Oh. I was hoping for maybe another key, but you can give me just money. Key, key, key. Absolutely. Why do I have spiders on that guy now that I think about it? Oh, well, Tiny Toma. Duh. What am I talking about? Judgment. How fun. It is a shame we had to pass up d6 for the rest of our lives but you know it is what it is i think having the ability to go hush when it was previously completely inaccessible is is markedly more important uh oh Well done. Well done. Uh, I don't really care about that. Fun. Show. Uh, and, you know, why the heck not take that? Um, we'll leave the judgment on hand. You never know. I could have gotten those chests, I suppose, with the temporary flight, but it's no biggie. Duality, not really important. Let's just take the health and buy the key too. Play this out. Genesis on the other side. I don't really care. I'm really happy with the way the runs are at the moment. So I will just leave it as such. And I'm perfectly fine just overloading this guy with all the health that I find. I don't see a problem there. Uh, yeah. Okay, and now we have full mapping. Yay! But yeah, I mean, like I, like I said, the whole... He will have, uh, and we do want to make sure that we are going into, so save some rooms, basically. Save some rooms this floor for, for clearing. But we do want to make sure we're going into Hush as dead, because that would be just, it's better. It's superior. It's the better choice. He does more damage, and unless something radically changes within this flow, I, I see no reason to believe that something would change with which to make me think oh yeah you know i should 
start using the guy with almond milk instead. Like, he's passable, at least, but it's not amazing. It's not a godly creature. And I will, like, at least get a charge out of this guy. Probably just the one, though. Alright. And like I said, just leave all these rooms. It's fine. You don't need to clear everything. I do want that. <laughs> uh, I think I'd rather have the other guy getting it, though. He's got... We've got plenty of damage. Ow. <laughs> we got relatively plenty of damage on uh, this fool. But the other one is, is below average still. Which was more obvious that there was a double before I got rammed into him, but whatever. We're nearly at base damage! Can you believe it? Can you believe it, guys? We're quarter to base damage. That's not true. We're, we're, we're like six eighths the way they are. As opposed to three fourths. It's a completely different number, actually. Maybe uh, unfamiliar, or perhaps not even believe me at all. But it's true. Also, great, we can now have strength on this guy, too. Even better. Hey. Wish we did have Trinity Shield on, uh, the Sword Man, because it would be better. But, it is what it is. Okay. Uh that there because I'm gonna pick this up and I'm gonna be great on health forever. That was like one of the few times that I've made amazing use out of uh, that, that was great great thing there shame to take damage but great play of, of re-rolling though. Happy with that. So I think it's funny that the uh, the shield still looks invisible when you flip over. I love minor visual bugs. Okay. So, we got plenty of rooms to clear. We will kill Mom's heart here. That'll be just fine. No issues. We got holy crap on the B side there. Show. Why the heck not? And I uh, we'll take advantage of the the free flip backsies while we're here. And it's a charge. Lots of value. Okay. Uh. Grab this health. And then, um, okay. Here's, a, here's the play. Let's get a flip charge. Because I don't know, and I don't want to risk it, but I don't know if you, um, if you use, well, I guess, I don't know, I'll just get the charge. I'd... Regardless, I don't know if uh, if you use Mama Mega, will that stay open when you leave the room? I don't. I don't know. So I don't want to. I don't want to risk it. Granted, if I do get this flip extra flip charge from, from this guy, how useful it'll be, I don't know. We might not have much value at the very least. There's a good chance that we don't get to use it until after we defeat Hush, and that would be okay. You know. There's also a good chance we don't need to use it. We could have uh, peak items, and they can both go to dead last. <laughs> uh, and, you know, also, let's blow all these up just for money. We could use a little bit more. Okay. Then let's, uh, yeah, let's... <laughs> so nice, the... The key does still, or the, the sword does still interact with objects and whatnot. Okay. 
Man, I could check out the super secret room. I guess I will. There's a lot of good things it could be. Mega chests, pills. Hey, that's pretty good. It's pretty relevant. Question marks. As long as you don't put me in a room right now, I'm I'm not gonna be flippant with you. It's not how you use the world, for the record. Oh yeah, it's hush. Let's do this thing. Guess we can use this you know, flip charge as a. I am perfectly fine not finding any more actives ever. Oh, it got reeled. I was I was very confused for a second because I know we took this as a as the dead one a while back. The range can go to the other guy. Oh, <laughs> ah, ah, ah. We got revelations on the beach chat. We gotta make sure we have 14 cents, so don't overplay this. Uh, alright, that's fine. You, you can have this. Uh, buy all this. Grab nonsense. Uh, I guess we can play this too. Whatever, who cares? It doesn't matter. Do I look like I care? I don't even care. I, I don't care who has this. And there you go. I do not want to tempt fate with revelations, uh, you know, or, or with, 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 with Trisagian uh, on the pop fellow. I think that's very risky. Uh, and I'm, I'm, I'm A-OK -okay with this. I don't care. I don't care to push this any further. Flatstone. Uh, that sounds fun for living, Laz. You can have that. Zodiac and Piercing Tears. Uh, I think Piercing Tears would be good also for living, so I could give Flatstone directly, and then I don't know, we'll just see what happens. If there's a battery in here, there is a battery in here, so we could, uh, once we flip over, utilize that there. Obviously, you can uh, have that if we find the money in this shopkeep right now. Okay, unsurprisingly. Uh, but yeah, so... Everything's just going to the living mass, and that's okay. Pop the strength code right off the bat. No, we'll just... I don't care, whatever, just get in there. You get him, dead lads. We can use some revelations action. Seems to do pretty good stuff. Oh, you did not make your presence known, so... So I like how living is now just kind of a, a nice warm yellow glow. Warm piss yellow glow. Revelations is going to town. Maybe it's the sword, I don't know. <laughs> One of them. I think it's Revelations. Okay. Get down here. <laughs> You're starting to make my screen go in ways I do not care for. Can I just spam this? What was that? What does that turn into? Damage? Optimally? Perhaps. Oh! There you go. I'll just do some revelations while he does the, the continuum. Ow! How will I recover from this loss of HP? Now... There is something worth considering. What if I just went straight to the lair? I kind of like that idea, actually. I think I'm going to do that. Because this is a good run. 
and you need a good run to be delirium. So if there's ever a time, this is it. This is the time. That was the time. Silver Vizard has been in the basement. Not a very good soul stone, but you you live in your loan. Okay. Oh wait, no, 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 he can't can't have it. They do be bouncing though. I don't think he can have it. If I'm not mistaken, the other lad does not have the ability with which to uh fully charge his item. I don't know. What, what, what could be in that sack? Perhaps the ability with which to charge his item. I must try. Okay, well, there's the ability with which to charge his item. Okay, great. More than enough. All right, I am no longer concerned. Apologies. Uh, do I want to take Zodiac 2? Usually the reason you don't take it is because of Libra, and in my case, Libra would be fantastic, so I'll take Zodiac. And it was already charged anyways. Glorious. So how about we just get some uh, some action here too on the on the side. Just for funsies. And you can still have Hive Mind. Wait. There we go. And now you can have Piercing too. Great. It all worked out. No worries. Alright. Let's go to Lyrium. I don't. I can't get that. Even if I want it. We have an Emperor Code. Uh, so if some godforsaken reason we're finding delirium as a uh, living, then we'll be all right. <laughs> we can TP out. Uh, I'll blow him up, sure. Fun. Anyways, uh, there's a couple guaranteed safes up into the right that I can see. Also, I have flight on this guy now. Very cool. And his revelations is still valid. Okay. I'm starting to think maybe living is the play now. Could just have some supplementary damage. Kind of treat uh, dead as the... Uh, as the, the, the little brim of, of ages past. Although he's still there. Get out of here. Um... Yeah, those two, those two up there are all safe. I do kind of like the idea. I think I think I'm probably gonna do that. Fight on living instead. I think I've been undervaluing him. It's a shame we didn't get a you know Libra on this flow, but obviously it's not a particularly likely thing to happen. So I guess I'm not surprised. I'll leave an extra battery in case for some reason we need to flip. Desperately need an item on one character. Yeah, I don't, I don't care. I don't care as that. Um, I mean, if it is delirium, I'm perfectly fine just going to delirium. I guess I'll just, just do this. Just do this. Okay, hello, the magician. That would be great if this is delirium. Oh yeah. Alright, this is peak. I think this is as good as we can do against delirium right here. We got a crap ton of projectiles. They got homing. They got splash damage. <laughs> what? Why are those so tiny? That's a little odd. Well, we have uh, we have we have a very solid thing here. We also have flight, so we don't have to care about creep. That was a concern for us, which I mean, yeah, there's a fair few enemies that uh, should creep, so it's a nice thing to not have to think about, at the very least. Okay, this is the time to get the damage going, because he is uh, he has little to no boss armor when he is uh, in this form. He's uncloaked, you know, just raw delirium. Fortunately, he does not stay there very often. But here's the time again. 
It's really hard to see the Revelation charge bar on uh, on the second guy here, but why is there two? You have no reason to have two. <laughs> like, those aren't even things you, like, Mega Zig can spawn or whatever. It's not... Usually when there's two, it's because something got spawned via something else, but no, that was just there, just chilling. Almost down, like an eighth of their health left. Keep switching back to normal, and I'm really appreciating it. Thank you. I, I, I should thank him. It's been a great help to me killing him. And that is that. Fantastic. And that unlocks. Arguably their best unlock. It's up to opinion on that front. It's either, uh, I think, reverse judgment or flip. Because flip for other characters. There's no thinking about, oh, do I want to have a... Uh, do I want to flip over to my other person? No, you're just getting another item, basically, from any static pedestal. It's a fantastic item. It's great. It makes the Seeker Room pool even better. And I am happy with that run. I'm very happy with that run. We got all the time stuff down, so now we don't even have to think about that. Uh, which is fantastic, because we still have to do three more runs with these guys. So not having that over our shoulders is fantastic. Well, full probably uh so yeah great happy about it um yeah thank you for watching hope you enjoyed and i'll see you next time see you